I'm out here in the forest to test a new external monitor. It's the 5 inch monitor from Field World. It's a full HD monitor, it has 4K HDMI input and output. And I'm here to test it out to see what are the benefits of using such a monitor for photography or for filming. So let's go and try to find a much more suitable spot because here you can't see anything around me. I don't know if you realize, but I just made the 360 turn. So <laughs> let's wait a little bit and get to the forest and we'll talk about it. talking about an external monitor for your DSLR and first of all why would be the reason to go and purchase such a uh, such an accessory well one of the reasons is that the monitor of your camera is really small and you see very difficult uh, the details or the composition lines it's not the end of the world though you can do very well uh, only with your um, camera's monitor as I did before but an external monitor brings some features that are not available on your camera's monitor and one of the best features that I will start this review with is false color the ability to see false color is extremely useful especially if you're photographing or filming people because when you are pressing that button that shows you false colors uh, the monitor will show you an image that looks odd, all sorts of colors on the, um, on the display, but you will have uh, a grid to your right and you will see what those means. Basically zero is black, 100 is absolute white. And for example, if you're going to photograph or film people, you will want the skin tones to be in a light gray area. Now this external monitor from Field World is a 5-inch monitor. It has full HD resolution. It has 4K input and output uh, in the format of HDMI. The monitor came with a um, cable that goes from HDMI to micro HDMI. Now I didn't have on my Canon camera a micro HDMI port, I had only a mini port and that is why you saw that white cable. This was the, the, the available cable that I had in my house. So if you want to have something more <laughs> beautiful looking you will search for a black cable but be very careful to buy an HDMI cable that supports 4K or says on it version 1.4 otherwise it won't work with this monitor. Now uh, the monitor has a really good construction. Uh, I had the misfortune of dropping it <laughs> when I took it uh, out of my backpack and nothing happened to it so it works very well for now. I don't know how many drops it will take but for now it's, it's really good. Uh, also snow fell on it from one of the trees and again nothing happened. The visibility uh, that uh, you have when you're looking at uh, inside that monitor is really good and the uh, hood shade is really useful for when there's uh, a lot of light into your surrounding so it's a, it's a helpful feature now in terms of power you can power it with the usual sony uh, chargers but this monitor also works with canon chargers with canon batteries so this is very useful for me because i'm a canon owner so that means i have lots of canon uh, um, batteries as a minus that i see with this monitor the lack of a touch screen it's a little bit strange because I have on my camera a touch screen and whenever I want to focus on a certain point I just put my finger on it and the camera focuses so this would be the only minus with this monitor and then that I think it's a great tool and I really think it's a tool that will help you elevate your photography or uh, videography simply because you will be able to see much better the composition and that thing that it's called false color, the ability to see that. For example, when I'm here inside the forest, there may be some small areas that get overexposed, but 
maybe that are not that important to the scene. I don't know how much I'm gonna use it uh, in my photography. I don't know how often I'll be able to take it. You need to uh, get used to using this kind of monitor. You need to understand that it's, it's kind of like a professional tool. It, yes, it builds up on your camera. It adds gear to you, your backpack and to your camera but it also offers something back. Now this monitor is available worldwide. You can order it from any country. You have links in the description of this video. I really hope you enjoy this small review and uh, just give me your feedback. Maybe you own this monitor, maybe you have other monitors. Just use the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel for more similar videos. Bye bye.